Hello, everyone. Here we are uh, with a drawing inspired by the great Carl Gustav Jung, psychiatrist, psychologist, psychoanalyst from Switzerland. Um, this is a uh, practicing active imagination, generating an artifact on paper. Okay, so uh, I have here the exciting list: how to how to practice active imagination. Number one, you concentrate helps to grow the mind. Number two, you focus on a dream. Number three, let the unconscious speak. Number four, generate an artifact on paper. Analyze the message and practice. So this is my, like my daily uh, practice, drawing, having an espresso, uh, sitting in the morning, getting all my, my, my thoughts together. So here we have the self-portrait would be the animus, me, and the model, the anima, anima, the female. So the uh, it really shows how we are all interconnected, okay? We're all interconnected in a, in a quantum way, in a cosmology way. Meaning, this is, a, this is a singularity here in quantum, okay? This loop here that loops this way. Then I start the drawing. The drawing starts very whimsical, where I do... Um, what they call gestural drawing, so you're interconnecting a line on a line, not really looking at the paper. Then when you're done, you start going back into an area, and you start defining the area, and then you put the eyes and the nose and all that. But the most important thing is that you want to interconnect everything with this loop called singularity in quantum mechanics. You want to you want to connect everything interconnected, so you start seeing how we are not only interconnected with our feet and hands, right, feet and hands, minds were interconnected at a very intrinsic energy level. E equals mc squared, energy, mass, sp speed of light, okay? It's all interconnected. So um, the idea is that part, part, of, part of this the relationship is even though we are in the 3D and we might not be connected in the 3D, we're still interconnected in the 4D. 4D will be the non Euclidean geometry, 4D will be the fourth dimensional space, but we are connected like Einstein, we're entangled in space time. Okay, thank you very much for watching.